И снова здравствуйте, дорогие друзья, меня зовут Леонардо, и мы продолжаем проходить такую замечательную игру, как Bear With Me. И сейчас нам надо пойти в тот контейнерный терминал. Но, хочу вам сначала сказать, значит, посмотрите сначала предыдущую серию, потому что она была полна мук и недогадок, и страданий, так скажем. Вот что бывает, когда вслепую проходишь какую-то головоломочную или упоротую игру, в которой нет. Иногда появляются какие-то нелогические загадки, так скажем. Я надеюсь, им этот шлагбаун, блин, мешать не будет. А то если мне придется шлагбаун поднимать, то... То я не знаю, я буду материться. Fences. Fences indeed. Do you? I wonder what's inside all of these containers. You don't want to know. Реально, что там, кстати? I wonder what's inside. You don't want. Так тут никуда не пройти, да? CBG really hates the birds, unlike Mr. Birdwatcher over here. I wonder what's in. You don't want. Так, стоп. Вот. We should get back to the harbor doll. You're right. Да. О, о. Окей. Так, стоп. Funny, but ain't gonna work. Нет. Funny, but ain't gonna work. Нет. А для чего мне эта рыба? Funny. Опа. Уже что-то происходит. А, да, чайки прилетят. БЛМ об этом узнает и отгонит их. Ну, и где он? Filthy beasts. Ah, that one. That one over there. He's the Michael. I mean, he's the ringleader, Ted. You know? You know what they're doing, don't you? Seagulls. Yeah. Generally, they fly around looking for fish and making annoying sounds. But no, 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 no. Open your eyes. Surveillance, Ted. Surveillance. They're the flying cameras. They monitor the entire city from up there. The seagulls. No bear. <laughs> They're just the means. Huh. It's good to see you again, buddy. Yeah, yeah. Good to see you too, Ted. Is that the girl? She's grown. Hi, CBG. Long time no see. It's been too long, kid. Why the hell would you bring her here, Ted? It's not safe for her anymore. What do you mean? The city is not your playground anymore, girl. Not since that monster showed up. You're talking about Red? Shh. Keep your voices down. Especially with all them birds around. CBG, we're looking for Flint. Yeah, he's gone missing, and we fear the Red Man had something to do with it. Or at least, we hope he's hiding here in the city. Flint? You two came to the wrong place to look for him. Paper City is the place where people usually end up to go missing. Okay, so I gather you didn't see him. Did you have the time to look around, Snoop? The city's in chaos! I could have easily missed him even if he were here. Which I doubt. Honestly, can't even remember when was the last time I saw the kid. Millie told me he was missing since last night. Millie? Yeah, she escaped the city through the East Tunnel's maintenance route together with the Mugshot Boys. Clever! Those two have potential. The shame they were always leaning on the wrong side of the fence. So they're staying with you now? For the time being. Rusty is there also. Good girl. Just keep them away from here for now. The city is a ticking time bomb! How are you holding up, B? We've heard you've been scaring the harbor workers around here lately. No, no, no. They're okay. Hard-working bunch, the salt of the sea and all that jazz. They get scared easily is all. Are you using your deep voice when you're talking to them? No! I got old! Hurts my throat nowadays. 
What do you know about Red? Here's what I know, Ted. He came down to Paper City a week ago. And now he's burning it down from the inside out. Where did he come from? He just appeared in the city one day. But the trail leads to the woods on Sorrow Hills. And I have a feeling he was invited. Invited? By whom? Think about it, Ted. The elections are coming up. There's a new candidate on the rise. The one that was dabbling in criminal activity since forever now. King. Hmm. The one and only. And why would King do this? He already has an entire city in his grasp. Seems odd he would bring in someone to help him, especially someone who's obviously unhinged and hard to control. For his own personal gain, I mean, the casino is still standing. Unburned. Could be just a coincidence. It could. Just that I don't believe in coincidences, girl. What makes you think it was King? Have you been to the mill? It's where it all started, Ted. The police did such a sloppy job, you'd think someone was paying them off. The pigs. It's where we're heading next. Where? To the mill, B. Oh yeah, yeah, right. Go there, Ted. Do a little investigation of your own. Okay, B. I'll bite. Let's say King really brought Red to the paper city to get leverage on mills. But what could King possibly offer to someone like this? There seems to be only one thing he's interested in. And you brought her right to King's doorstep. I know Red has been asking around about her. But what I want to know is why. Why? Who really has the power in Paper City? Is it the mayor, that pig, the shark and his goons? No, Ted. It's her. Amber. The girl. Yes. She made the city, and it seems he came here to tear it down instead. He won't stop until he finds her, and it seems Shark is desperate to arrange this meeting. But it seems to me, Red has his own agenda. This is what happens when you're so dependent on the tool you're using that it ends up using you. If I find out King's behind all of this, he's going down. For good this time. You go home, and stay away from the docks. For the love of God, you live in a mansion. It's where they gather, Ted! The seagulls! Oh yeah, I forgot about the seagulls. Come on, B. It's time to hang it up. I can't retire just yet, Ted. There's too much sadness on these streets. Still, especially now that you're retired. You've heard about that. How could I not? The folks down at your old street held a two-day vigil. It's a damn shame, I tell you. Time waits for no bear, B. I got old. Nonsense! You're as sharp as a thumbtack, Ted. Always were. We have to go now, B. Do what you gotta do, Ted. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. I found this at the steel mill the other day. Take it. See if you can analyze it, Ted. What is it? It looks like some sort of a voodoo charm. This only proves what I've been telling you about King. Hmm. Seems a bit odd. King would leave something so obvious at the crime scene. I know, but at least take it with you. Maybe it can lead you in the right direction. All right, B. See you around. I hope you're a good golfer. CBG, can I ask you for a favor? What is it? Clark fell into the water near the diner. Can you check on him and make sure he gets out okay? Sure thing, girl. I'll get that idiot out. Okay, so we should go and see about the steel mill first, right? I was thinking maybe we could go and see Tigrin Jones about the voodoo charm he found. What? I'm not going to see that witch. That's nonsense. It's not nonsense. It's a lead. If anyone can tell us more about it, it's her. You never listen to my ideas. It's always about you and your stupid clues and... Fine. Okay. Let's just hurry up. Voodoo, I mean really. But after that, we're going to the steel mill. Voodoo. <laughs> Какой-то он странный. Что там? Могу быть тигрен. Везде больше ничего не доступно. Жаль. Paper City. I always had kind of a love-hate relationship with this place. I have to admit, and hand it to Amber. She really made this city feel the way it's supposed to be. It's gritty, dark, dirty and unforgiving. But most of all, it feels alive. It's almost as if the city itself could be a main character in some forgotten script on the desk of a writer who shot himself before he could write an ending. Everyone here has got a story to tell, and if you lend them your ears for a couple of minutes, you can find out just about everything. And in these dire times, that's the main reason why I decided to return. Well, at least I keep telling myself that. I have to admit, it feels good to be back. 
It feels right. Paper City makes sense to me. People here, they make sense to me. It was good to see Betty again. I would never say this in front of her, but I miss her sometimes, and I messed up. I did. It's good to see she's fine and well. She's always had an admirable joy for life, and I'm glad that hasn't changed. CBG, on the other hand, is getting worse by the day. Most of the time, he just raves on about seagulls and other nonsense. It's a shame, but he always had a nose for sniffing out the bad, especially in this rotten place. Этим мне удивляет, что он его смирительно на рубашке. Так ощущение, будто он из психушки сбежал. Знаете, мне вот такие вот ролики напоминают Макса Пейна. Да те, кто играли, тебя поймут. Тед, это он! Он здесь! Тед, Тед! Что? Я здесь, Дол. Что происходит? Ты не видел его? Он? Он был только здесь. Где? Right in front of us. Where did you go? I literally didn't leave your side the whole time. What the hell are you talking about? I... I... don't know, but he was here. I saw him, Ted. Okay, just breathe. There was no one here, doll. This alley is dark and creepy, and it could have been anything, really. No, this was different. It was like that couple of times back at the house, remember? I guess. There were writings on the wall again. What did it say? I couldn't read it. I was really scared out of my mind. Something like, go get him, or something like that. Hmm. What are you thinking? Nothing. It's just, when we were back at the house, I could see it too. But now I couldn't. That is a bit strange. Let's just keep going. This stupid voodoo lead won't follow itself. You're stupid. I think it's all... I think it's all because of Так, дайте мне зайти sure меню, пожалуйста. Like sure. so no, Почему-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-то-
We are not going to look for lamps again if that's what you're going for. I bet it's a recipe. You goofball. <coughs> what? Does it say back in 20? No, it's really ambiguous. Wow, that's a big word for a 10 year old. I read at the 8th grade level, mind you. Okay, so now what? I don't know. I'll take this note with me and we can come back later. Maybe we can find out something more about all of this in the meantime. Sure. Can we go and see about the steel mill now? Okay, fine. Let's do what you want to do, like always. Okay, thank you. Ugh. Looks like a garage door. Probably is one. Ну ладно. Стоп, а где эта записка? Где эта записка? Где? Которую мы отсюда взяли. Ладно, наверное, недоступна. Опа. Это наша ли? Господи, как мелко написано. Ну ладно, видимо... Видимо, но тут все равно на английском, так что я не смогу перевести. Все остальные тени, завод и особняк мэра. А нафига нам туда идти? Пойдемте обратно. Ну ладно. Сейчас осмотримся и... It's a pipe, obviously. Hey, don't touch that. That's evidence. Здрасте, а вы, собственно, что тут делаете? Брайан? Oh. Если это Брайан, то почему тут написано Стиви? Непонятно. Брайан? What? I'm not Brian, I'm Stevie. No, you're not. You're Brian Burke. Miss, my name is Stevie Walker. I know Brian Burke. We work together and we look nothing alike. Are you kidding? You're identical. Is that mustache real? Of course it is! Why? Does Brian have a fake mustache? No, no, he has a real mustache, and it's better than yours. <laughs> he wishes. Wait, so am I supposed to play along and pretend you're not really Mike? Who's Mike? Ugh, he means Brian. I'm not Brian! We're totally different! He's a whiny, flat-faced nerd, and I'm the devil make hair dangerous and super handsome type. Just look at my mustache! Look at it! They're kind of sleazy. Are you also the sleazy type? Is there something I can help you with? This here is a crime scene, so, you know, carry on. Can we have a look-see inside? Absolutely not. Doll, I got this. I know how these things go down. So, Sammy. Stevie. Is there something we can get you to make your shift here a bit more comfortable? Are you suggesting a bribe? Because that might be a federal offense. Might be. You're not sure. I am not, actually. I mean, it's a type of offense for sure. Listen, I know how much you guys make. It's not a lot. What do you say? We give you a little something-something, and you let us snoop around for, like, a minute. Hmm, I don't know. Come on, man. I thought we were dealing with the devil-may-care dangerous guy here. <sighs> Guess I was wrong. Whoa, whoa, you are. I mean, I am dangerous and handsome. So handsome. I mean, I'm getting dizzy over here, Ted. Doll's getting dizzy over there, Stan. Okay, fine. What do you have? What? Isn't that how these things go down? You have to give me something that's like the definition of a bribe. <sighs> I haven't thought this through, to be honest. Well... <laughs> what? You're terrible at this. Away with you both. Come back when you can actually follow up on your offer. Stop. Monieta, no? Hmm. Hey, how about a proper old-fashioned bribe? Hmm. I don't know. Ну да. Попытка подкупа. Я такие и называю эту серию, наверное. Ну-ка. Let us in or I'll shrink your head. Is that a thing? О, кстати. Would you care for this level six sword, finest Italian craftsmanship? What am I supposed to do with this? Ладно. Ну-ка. There you go, buddy. You're welcome. The amazing world of bubbles. 
What the hell is this? It's a pamphlet that'll make you a billionaire. It's your ticket out of here. The one chance to make it. Mom's spaghetti and all that. What am I supposed to do with this? Read it cover to cover. Take a seminar or two. Boom. You're in. In where? The big leagues, buddy. The big leagues. Is that a thing? Oh, it is, Stevie. I've seen it. Really? How was it? They... they should have sent a poet. Can you feel it, buddy? Feel what? The warmth. I can feel it. What is it? It's a blanket made of money, keeping you warm on the cold winter nights. A blanket made of... Money. All right, go on in. Nothing in there but rubble and ash anyways. <laughs> Idiot. Once I'm a billionaire, I'll buy the police station and fire that stupid rich. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Stupid rich with his stupid wife and stupid kids. No, for the let that idiot dream. Wow, he's really gullible. That's not a good quality for a police officer. Oh, you know idea. Taking a bribe is. Good point. No, let's see if he sees it. I'll just confiscate this. Obviously. Medvedev doesn't stop at the beginning of his fingers, do you? Okay. What else? Ashes and rust. Sounds like Hemingway's book title. Hemingway? Oh, да ладно. Тут фигурирует Хемингуэй. Looks like this could move the crane. Я можно взять? Интересно. Handle is missing, though. Wow, someone really did a number on this place. Stop. Ashes and rust. Sounds like Hemingway's book title. Hemingway's. Ah, I love Hemingway's. No, no, I really love Hemingway. Even the works that he wrote. Ah, what are you doing? You're a child. What? You know, establish a perimeter. What does that even mean? You know, establish a perimeter. What does that even mean? Besides, do I look like a cop to you? No, you look like a homeless man. Well. Bear. Is it the stubble? It's more your posture and the dusty old suit. That's the color. It's dust noir. A dusty dark. Uh, color. It's just dust, Ted. It's falling off of you. Yeah. Well, this place is dusty. It's dusting up my. You're dusty. Now, let's get to work. God damn it! I don't feel like standing inside a burned-down factory at night for some reason. Ну как хочешь, Тед. Будем делать все как ты скажешь. It looks like a wrench of some sort. You know your tools. That's an adjustable wrench. And what are you, a plumber? No, that was kind of taken. Так, стоп, я хочу это взять. I'll just take this adjustable wrench with me. Adjustable. That's what I said. Ashes and rust. Sounds like Hemingway's book title. Хорошо, обломки опять. Looks like it survived the fire. Wonder what's inside. Даже не знаю. We can't reach it from down here. Дай проверим. Sure wish we had that magical attic hook with us right now. Oh yeah. Whatever happened to that? It served its purpose, I guess. Wouldn't want to make things too easy now. Ну да, я уже знаю, что надо делать. Наверное. Maybe something less destructive? Чё? Чё? Прослушал. Maybe something less destructive? Ага. Так. Подождите. Doesn't seem to work. Так, ладно. Может отсюда? I wonder if the crane still works. That's a Liber original doll. Germans are sure building them to last. Немцы. Maybe something less destructive? А что мне делать тогда? Так, подождите. 
looks like this could move the crane. Двигать кран, я знаю. Попробуй подвигать кран. Handle is missing, though. Рукоятки нет. А с чем мне сделать рукоятку? О. We got a wrench pipe. It's a mighty tool. There we go. Good as new. Seems like it's stuck. We should oil it up. Ага. А у нас как раз есть вот это. There. Good as new. Он так уже второй раз говорит. Забери инструмент. Зато мне подсказывает, что он, ему, он еще пригодится. Подойдите ка оттуда. Его можно забрать? А, нет. Нет, нельзя. Блин, вот квас так меня иногда раздражает то, что один предмет можно использовать только один раз. И правда раздражает. Westpark Casino matches. B was right. This is a solid lead doll. So you think King's behind all of this? Let's not jump to conclusions just yet. What do you think we should do? Let's talk to Mills about this. I want to see how he'll react when he finds out his buddy might be behind this. Hmm. Спички. Ну ладно, ребят, давайте тогда на этом заканчивать. Надо поставить Эмбер в такую позу, чтобы она и тогда не сгораживала. Ладно, ребят, давайте на этом заканчивать. У нас, ну, судя по вот этим вот неактивным кнопкам, то есть эта красная рамочка никак не светится. Но ухлакаться у нас пока нету. Ладно, ребят, давайте уже прерваться. Я надеюсь, вам все понравилось. Если это так, делайте то, что нужно. На этом у меня все. Всем большое спасибо за ваше внимание. С вами был Леонардо. До скорых встреч. И помните, веселье только начинается.